Hi everybody, welcome back to Mickey Rooney Saves the World. I'm Lucky Jack 20. <laughs> Mickey Rooney. Rooney. Hype and James. And we are in a bit where... Too far. Okay, I'm just going to get myself unhypnotized real quick. I must I'm going to steal videos. this, I'm going to sneak this piece of cheese. Oh, because remember that uh, anti-theft mechanic. Oh. I love that part. <laughs> and because the and because the bonk knocked us out, now the problem is is it's not just that. Remember, we have to like face the intruder in our dreams and get rid of them or whatever that whatever and that monologue was. Yep. And in this case, Whoa. everything. And I mean everything. Well, maybe not everything, but yeah. Ah, oh, crap! It's been also done this. I forgot. I already forgot. Brady culture. Brady culture. Yeah, Brady culture. That's it. <laughs> For a moment, I was about to say Mickey Rooney. <laughs> Holy in a blender. I'm still so yeah, we need to face the intruder and destroy it. So yeah, we basically need to remove destroy all the you, all the Brady thank heads. You disembodied voice of Sybil. And you know, just real quick, shut up! I'm the one in charge here, babe. Oh, oh hey there, Max. Oh, well, Brady stole my body. I hate when don't mind me. That. Just a normal occurrence in the everyday life of a rabbity thing. Okay, little guy, I'll save you. But I was just about to so, say, yeah, considering his shape, the fact that he's sticking out of the overhead light there actually seems somewhat fitting. Brady culture on TV. It does. Yes. Right where I belong. Some great cultures on TV. Everyone you gotta watch me. Yeah. Quick, change the channel. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, okay. we gotta cut Bob Ross what off the air. Happen to the picture quality if I gave this a tug. No, and then right here, we're just gonna, we're just gonna take care of this dog. Uh, no. Yeah, sorry. That's what happens when you're in bad oh, network, yes, in bad network perception. development areas. Okay. May he, may you rest in peace, good sir. I'm sorry also, that, I'm, and I'm, also, and I'm sorry that a certain Metallic keeps on ragging on you, Mario Kart. Whoop. A lot of cheese. And, oh, what the I, hell? He keeps, <laughs> keeps scaring the little rat away. Oh come on, really? Eating. Let's make him not so let's little. Make, let's make. Thanks to what is it? Fool. Like to let's make it. Uh, let's make him pick on someone his own size. Choo choo, choo choo, choo choo, choo choo. No, the cheese must stand alone. No, but cheese is Whoa. cheese is a better dish that's accompanied with other things like bread and meat. And another one Seriously. Also, yeah. I was gonna say, um, I don't like. I, I, it annoys me this like distorted version of the Office music because I like it too much. <laughs> Can oh. I just shoot out that bulb? Oh, I wish. Oh, wait, there you go. Whoop. Going up. Whoa. Yeah, this is where gotcha. I, this is where I have to say like this is where I have to say okay, that was point and click adventure logic, but whatever. It don't is because honestly, when I played this part, this took a while for me to figure out. <laughs> yeah, and. A much simpler, uh, and much, a much simpler answer. On your career, Brady, Brady culture, turn off the dark. <laughs> no! Dink. Oh, that Brady culture. Brady culture, turn turned off. off with his smile. Ha! He will never face the light, or fight the light, or attack the light. I forget oh, what the frickin' Steven Universe is. Attack, the, it's attack the light. Really? Attack the light. And in the oh, sequel, we save the light. Yay. And, and now we save the light. Nom, 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 nom. Oh my. <laughs> you alright, Max? <laughs> What? Mm. A little too sugary. Thanks, Sam. A little stringy, <laughs> but good. Oh, I just remembered. I'm supposed to be somewhere. Hi, Max. <laughs> okay. Yoink. I gotta be in a circle wipe that... across town. Oh. And what oh. took me about it took me about ten to twenty minutes. Took Logan about like three. All right. <laughs> yeah. To be fair, I'm not really good at these games. To be fair, I'm not really good at these kinds of games, but I do figure it out after a while. Yeah, and you know what? Just, I'm not quite sure if this will make you feel even more inferior, but it's kind of funny you mentioned difficulty, James, because I think a reoccurring critique that a lot of people have with the puzzles in Season 1 of this, uh, I think Seasons 2 and 3 do a better job of it, but a lot of people like to complain that the puzzles in Season 1 are a little on the easy side. A, a bit, I mean, all things considered, I mean, I have, I was able to beat this game for the most part without using a guide, and... I wouldn't say easy so much as simple because they added a lot more complexity to the game in season two and season three, and in, in terms of like how how far you could go and how many items you were using because the game could handle more space in it. Mm -hmm. mm. Well, that'll, that'll only mean something once we actually get to those game those games. Max isn't gonna so like what it. I'm doing here our, is that because we realize we're just gonna get possible. hypnotized every single time we go there, we need to construct an anti-hypnosis hat or something to prevent myself from being hypnotized. God damn, what a time What a time not to ask for Bosco's help. Well, yeah, here's guess, the thing. Oh no, that's a, a, that's about, a joke they'll make in season two. <laughs> and I was about to say, in this instance, it's not actually Bosco we're going to go to for this. Not anyway. It's not Sybil. right away anyway. Sybil's the best person to know about uh, this Just a second, thing. I'll be right back. No worries. Alrighty. 
In the meantime, let's go. Let's go take Sybil out of the closet. I've got a rescue. So okay, now here's the other thing. Notice that Sybil is not there. Mm -hmm. She's supposed to be there. I found out by a glitch she was behind the door still. Son of a bitch. Yeah, I had a mouse and find that. That's it's like <laughs> wow. And then, it, then it like because my guess is oh, remember God. how. I was going to say, because remember how earlier in this episode she was trapped in the closet with peepers outside? No. Uh-huh. I guess when I went back, it loaded her behind the closet still. Of course. So I had to click on her there in order to activate it here. got to find some way to block a hypnotic ray. The season one original download non-Steam version of this game is a little anything. Yeah, I was about to say, like, I own the Steam version. I never came across any really bad glitches like that. I mean, honestly, I, I had to suffer without, without a run button, but even then, like... For the, for the most part, the game was completely well, stable. It's a Thank you, DRM free. And it was at 60 frames. Tell you about it, mm. But, one but of yeah, more don't worry, everybody. Like, this is like the worst of it. Season 2 and Season 3 will be much better. Even future episodes won't be this buggy. Good. That's just the sort of ridiculously lucky I need that break. It's a huge <laughs> yeah, seriously. I mean, have you seen my mind lately? ...ethical conduct, of course. But you being a policeman of sorts, I suppose it's okay to give you the diagram. Thank you. Hmm. My lack you of want a colander is finally caught up with me. and I can't a, make any sense and a hanger. I'd love to help, but engineering is one of the few fields I haven't tried. So uh, I, I, tried. I, I felt like I reached my hand into this computer as a now fully like degree holding engineer and do something about it, but I can't. Well, I go to the other nut job. Yeah. Because this town, town doesn't have enough of them. So let's just... <gasps> I know. Let's just pop over and... This will be good This will be good for my glutes. Hmm. I always wonder if, like... I don't know. I, 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 don't, I don't know how he can run Moscow, around barefoot all the time. I always get so this. nervous running around barefoot near the streets of rocks and things. Well, let's also, let's also remember here, Logan. He's a dog. Tech yeah, it's true. Ooh, that's that's the the for that yeah. yeah, I can build this. Just need one thing. What? What's that? Something for that antenna thing at the top. Oh, and so, Got like, it. the coat hanger from our TV. Well, ain't that a coincidence? I just pulled this off my TV. Well, make do antenna for no make do actual antenna. reason, unless yeah, okay. I was a Let's Player and knew what I was doing about this beforehand. Or if you know adventure game logic. Here it is, the most Anything and everything can work. He literally, seen. there was no, there was, there was no... Uh oh, seems like the old Moolah game. Well, to be fair, at least he's, at least he's not making us pay, pay an arm and a leg for it. Just stop that Brady I just like, I love that like there's nothing, it. like no, no even like You're fancy tape. Dimension, he literally Roscoe. just popped you the antenna onto the, the next one, though. Well, it's a good thing this thing has so many holes. Ha. Speaking of holes, let's uh, let's go take care of that Brady culture. I, I'm going to pretend I know exactly what you're referring to right then and there, so let's just, let's go say Max. Let's go say Max. Let's, let's, let's beat this episode. Yeah. By the end of this video, he will be full of holes. Be better, right? That'd be cool. All right, we're here. Fortunately, we don't have to present a freaking document again. Nope. We the door still the door will be open for all times, at least until the end of the episode. Yeah, at least. Where we'll never have to worry about this place Always again. Wear protective headgear when confronting diabolical villains with hypnotic devices. Just pop that on top of my hat, and he'll never know the difference. Really, he's he's really not because he's you know you gotta imagine the kinds of stories he get he talks about in, during his high school reunions. Sam, boy, am I glad to see you. Johann Sebastian here only knows how to play one song. Oh, oh. What's this, a rerun? You really shouldn't have. Didn't you surely shouldn't have dropped your day job as an artist kid. Episode? Well, if you really want to watch it again, it's not gonna work. Wah. Right back at you. Triumph for skanky ingenuity and ordinary. Yeah. Work. Give it up, culture. Your quiche is cooked. Time out for the cavalry! Oh, this not is you a guys. Brady culture. I mean, we see I you, like... And this time we are going to get yeah, I was going to say, I appreciate the effort, but you guys don't have helmets. <laughs> I was just, yeah, you guys kind of forgot about that little plot, huh? So yeah. So now, my foolish pawns, attack the dog! And now it's time for the final battle between Sam and Brady culture and the soda poppers. Yeah, themselves. they're also kind of like they, they're also kind of idiots. So it comes mm -hmm. with a little bit of a word puzzle, pretty much. So I'm going to say I'm going to say I'm Brady Culture. I'm Brady Culture. <laughs> Do my evil bidding. Worship the videotape. Yes. Stop that. Nonsense. Attack the dog. Oof. Okay, well, that was fun. Um, hmm. How about oh, worship? Worship me. me. 
Worship me. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> me, me, worship me. You're oh, what a sore mine. loser. Me, me, me. And now, he's all like, he's all about me, 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 right? Attack, Attack me. me. No, me. Attack me, 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 me. There are so many possibilities you could do with this with this setup, but uh, we're just gonna go with a simple one, get it and get the move on. You played him like a two dollar glockenspiel. I learned all my best tactics in the first grade. That's pretty much it. I tried to send you semaphore signals with my ears, but you know how I always get the K and the I don't even know what semaphore is. You correct me. Me neither. Yeah, I guess they're out of it. Well, I guess we should dehypnotize these poor savages. Guess those soda guess the soda finally went to their heads. Here we go. Oh my. Oh. And, uh, let's get rid of this hypnosis crap. Well, that's that, Max. It looks cracked, but some more of the warnings. You actually do see that in your closet later. Thank goodness. Well, yeah, they keep, they hang on. No, no, they don't hang on to that. They hang on to his wig. Oh, right, his wig. For a moment, I thought they hung on to a different What the? What the? on your show, Myra. I'm a huge fan. I just can't seem to stop watching for some reason. Looks like our hypnosis days aren't fully over. It's now time for episode two, Situation Comedy. And yeah, I'm not adding little breaks because there's no point in showing the same credit sequence over and over again. So let's just get right back to it. Alrighty. Oh, he's got the tear grass grenade. Jesus Christ, Sam, you're overpowered here. Jeez, he's got a pistol. I got it. No, you don't. No, you don't. Ah, I got it. <laughs> You'll get it someday, Max. Hello. Yes. I couldn't yes. get subtitles on just yet. Sweet oh. mother of double jeopardy backstroking and butterscotch. We're on our way. Who was it? The Girl Scouts lawyers again? Nah. That was the commissioner. You'll never guess which unduly famous TV personality so, made the most So, just a quick question. Have, have they ever shown McLeod? the face of the commissioner in anything Sam and Max related? Myra Stump, the commissioner? The yeah. Daytime I do not believe I've ever Myra, seen as in America's mom, that him the or her physically ever. Not even in the TV show? Surely you jest. I don't believe She's so. holding her audience hostage and giving them Unless you want to like have some head cannon that has been the geek every, normally every endorse time. the use of the word dastardly. At this point I'll believe anything. This is clearly dastardly. I think. We must have been back on it though. The geek right pretty much did feel like did feel like a product of its time. I've been itching to bust some skulls since they canceled my so-called life. So let me get on the subtitles. There we go. There we go. This tear gas grenade launcher is just a solid shooter and some pureed onions. It works. It, believe me, it works. <laughs> yeah. you Welcome back, America. Today's Holy shit! What the hell's with that hairdo? She's like the you fairy godmother from Shrek too. She does kind of look hour. like her. Plus, in the is going to be a also, they've been doing this. They've been running this show for three and a half days now. Oh no God! We need sleep. Oh, I see. You were all thrilled when I gave you cars, then all expense paid vacations, and then well, so, well, so good that is when we can't even use them. Right, we can't even go home and install them. I haven't paid in weeks. I ever do is good enough for you. Maybe, maybe we'll start using non-dairy creamer someday. Oh, and she has the and she has them completely under her powers of guilt tripping and whatever else. Nobody trusts the slouch. Good old TV. It's the only way I still feel well adjusted. Damn, you're Max. You're never so just okay. Andy Hooser. Also, yeah, I just realized. Yeah, the Human Enigma sticker's still there. <laughs> ah, yes, I remember that case. Particularly. Gruesome. All I remember is that I believe up there, that well, that date that's on the that's useful. on the box there. Where else would we keep that is the date that, that was like the proposed. That was going to be the proposed like new Sam and Max game Lucas Arts was going to make. Ah, uh, oh, hello. Uh, Brady Culture's hair. It makes for an unwieldy but. Oh, so enchanting memento of our first case in a long while. I just, I don't know. I would have liked to. Like I would have liked to see a new Lucas Arts Sam and Max Good game. Time. If not Lucas Arts, then I don't know. A new, a uh, heck, a new Telltale season would be nice. I mean, they haven't touched this franchise in what three, four years. That's what I'm saying. Is like I genuinely think it may be to help you know reinvigorate, like reinvigorate um, interest in it that they should that they should make a Hit the Road remaster edition. Oh, dude, that'd be something else. Get this. I mean, I know this would probably be saying asking a lot, but maybe also get the actors from the new, newer games too, or provide the rules for the remake. I like Bill Farmer. Oh, I like him too. Well, you know what? That could also what be an way? option. What, what the, the fuck? Maximilian? What? The oh yeah. By the way, folks, get used to this because this is pretty much going to be an entire theme for this Not season. Really. 
it's me, Bosco. Ever since our first little run in, he keeps thinking What's people are on the him trainer, and decides to change his okay. appearance every single time. Uh, yeah. For now, he thinks he's a good, he's a good old Brit. Sam, what language is he speaking? I'm not sure, Max, but I think it might be English. <gasps> yes, the, <laughs> the taboo language. What made you convert to British? It's because everybody's got an in for me. Oh, you just think everybody's yeah, got it in for you. I had to get a disguise to throw What'd you do in your past life, Bosco? Find me now. They wouldn't even know where to begin to look. Not talking, eh? Gets the baseball bat out. Ah, uh, the poor cat. Six sure forces of evil are bedeviling you this time. It's the, the skin, skin bodies. bodies. Skin bodies? Skin bodies? Sounds like a pack of belligerent nudists. I, I think they are. The skin bodies Probably. Are like but ten times worse. Because... Truly They're entirely bald. Yeah, maybe a hundred. Yeah, times, goes a goes to show you should. There's some beaches you just shouldn't go to for one reason or another. What exactly? I've never even been. I've never even near a uh, beach I mean, once. Me neither. In fact, I don't even know the closest news beach to where I live. And I'll also, I don't really think I'd want to. Pinch, me neither. Last thing we want to see is an old, is a seventy year old's junk. Of course. Yeah, it seems to be the. I always hear, I hear Let's talks rude, about that sort of thing. Your fancy pants defense system stopping these skin bodies? All right, it'll just be us for the rest of this, but just fine, we can do this. Yeah, I've had to take a little sit out for now, but we got this. So? Nah, not terribly surprised. This whole, this whole day has been full of interruptions. Yeah, we're just fine. It's not a normal day for us. So I feel like we usually record. Usually Tuesdays and Thursdays, but I decided to take a shot and see. I am free Monday. Let's do that. Fair enough. We want to buy something. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. Uh, quite so. Quite so. Well, let's see what he has up for stock. What have you got? Well, there is still one kind of shaving cream the blooming skin bodies haven't okay, got. One yet. can left. Oh yeah, I love shaving. That's funny. I've never seen you shave. I didn't mean my stuff. Oh, okay. And oh dear. I have a most peculiar device behind the counter. Oh, that's the special thing. What <sighs> peculiar device are you so eager to pawn off on us this time? It's the latest in Bosco Tech. Come innovation. on, out with it. I want to say this. Invention I like to call a chemical based voice modulator. It's a voice changer. Voice <laughs> modulator? What's that? I do believe it's self explanatory. We don't yeah, really have pretty much time is. to explain it to ourselves. Yeah. Why don't you just explain it to us? Well, it alters the frequency of your voice molecule. Very useful, very useful. I just thought of a random fact I learned today. Not What's that, Logan? Right well, uh, on Wikipedia, if you ever want to see Thanks, a simplified Bosco. version of the article that you're currently reading, just on the left side of the window tab, just gonna shoot some hot wings and that crash can, <laughs> and uh, that those tickets, and that. And one of my favorite quotes in the game. What are you Not doing? that one. He's a crazy <laughs> okay, wait. God. Wait for it. Kill us one more. Are we going to give him And here it is. <laughs> no, come on. Okay, this next one. He's got a gun, and he doesn't know how to use yep. it. Yep. <laughs> okay, let's go get that last can that of does, shaving cream. That, you know what that does? That does sum up this series in a nutshell. goes clear to your ankles. What the? Hey! It's Jimmy. And he's naked. What a jerk. Oh, gosh. Black, bugger, blimey, bollock. The little black <gasps> he said bollocks. I mean, tell <laughs> this man's got some serious bollocks tell to it say it that. Ah, that's tell it So yeah, the um, that was quite an epidemic that happened. So we gotta go after that can of shaving cream because we're gonna need that for our uh, mission. Trust me, it's important. Yeah, you'd be, surpri you'd be surprised how useful that is to a dog. Where are we going, Sam? Hey. <laughs> the skin can't be That's a very fast little toy car. Reminds Seriously. Little, reminds me of Stuart After Little son. Rats. Yeah, it does kind of look like, seem like a Stuart Little thing to do. But, uh, uh, I never saw Stuart Little 2. How was it? I never saw that one either. I think I've, I've only really seen bits of the first one. The skin can't be I only saw the first one too. With uh, Was that Nathan Lane as the snowball? Uh, maybe? Honestly, I haven't seen that movie in years. 
So this is how it works. Whenever you shoot, the car tries to like, you know, drift away from you. So make sure it's in the center of the street. Uh, a little bit. You want to make it run. You want to make it fall into the open manhole in the middle of the street. So what's the relevance? What's the relevance for them being suddenly shaving, shaving themselves up to the, up to the head? It's just a phase they're going through, I imagine. There they go. See ya. Got it. Woohoo! Okay. Good old tight, surfing the highway. All right, let's get out here. Let's go back. We should go visit him later because I believe he's late on the rent. That'd be interesting. So, okay, thank you all for the sort of we apologize sort of small episode this was. We'll be all three of us will be back in the next part for when we will finally with this. I think that's really all we have to do. We can check in on Sybil and see what crazy things she's doing this time. But I think the main thing we're gonna finally go to the TV studio and figure out where this hypnosis is starting from. Yep, till so, next time, everybody. Bye-bye.